I'm right now going to draw a picture using four words. Okay, close your eyes if you want. Are you closed? Are they closed? All right. Here they go. These, these are the four words. Elephant in pink tutu. You see it? Elephant in pink tutu. Isn't it crazy? Right now, prancing and dancing up in your mind's eye is an elephant in a pink tutu. Whoop. I think uh, I just lost my video. Up oh, there, we're back. Isn't that crazy? Okay, now, here's the thing. I drew a picture, and you see it, and every single person sees something a little different. And this is what I want to encourage you to draw today, is an elephant in a pink tutu. And I myself, in just a moment, am going to draw my rendition of an elephant in a pink tutu. And it probably will look nothing like yours. And that's totally all right. You see, I think you're going to be able to learn something with how I approach. And I could learn something from you with how you approach drawing your elephant in a pink tutu. Words are powerful. And I, and I want you just to be able to see the beauty of art. See, art is simply getting others to see what you see, creatively packaged. To feel what you have felt, creatively packaged. So this is the joy and the beauty and the responsibility of art, is how to creatively package that what we see up here. So I wish you well in drawing your elephant in a pink tutu. Now, you, you ready to draw with me? Here, here we go. Let's, uh, let's do this thing. All right, so I'm going to... This is, this is the first time I've been able to push this little button here and uh, hopefully bring you to be able to see my screen. Now, what we're in right here is we're in Photoshop, Okay. Photoshop is what I draw most of my books in, and uh, I am going to simply start. Now, when I draw, all right, I usually start with the eyes. This is how I approach an elephant in a pink tutu. Another encouragement is go to the internet and look up elephants. What do elephants look like? And that's, uh, that's something we really need to always look at. Instead of just drawing what we think it could look like, we usually make some huge errors. Now, this is a cartoon little elephant of mine. Yours might be very highly realistic, and that, that's, that's wonderful. Here we go. There is my little nose. And I hope you guys have been enjoying those puzzles. It's been fun to be able to have that one back. And I am, uh, I am working diligently on my next one that I'm going to hopefully be able to see released here soon. And I'm going to now work the mouth. And there is the head of our elephant. Isn't that neat? Those little smile lines right there. Here we go. I just love all those folds of skin. So what does a little tutu look like? Hmm. Well, let's see. Yours? I wonder what yours looks like. Here we go. Look at that. Look at that. Her arms are outstretched. A little ballerina-ish. <laughs> mm. 
There she is. Now for the tutu. I'm thinking ahead of how do I want the legs, the, the little feet? To, do I have a leg splayed out? Do I have her on tiptoes? Uh, what is it? How do I want to capture our elephant? Here we go. <laughs> there we go. There's our elephant on her little tiptoes. with her leg back and a little tail. And what is missing here? Does anybody know? Yeah, you're right. Little squeakers. Let's put little squeakers over here. Running along, getting out of the way. <laughs> and here we go. This is Elephant in pink tutu. Now, when you draw your elephant in a pink tutu, there's something you need to do. What is it? After you're done, what I encourage you to do is sign your name, all right? Put your little signature on this and then say uh, the date. How about, how about we do this, age? I think I'm 47 and we're talking April, what is this, 21st, 2020. Why do you sign and date it? Why would you go through that little trouble? Why? Because all growing up, I drew in sketchbooks and my dad would always date it. And what was so cool about that is I can actually go back and see all the drawings I did, what my age was, and what you can do is you can actually see how you have improved. Or you can learn how you never want to do it again, whatever it might be. But dating it and signing it, an important thing. So I encourage you to be able to, uh, to do that very thing. So there's, there's our elephant. And uh, you guys, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to answer some questions here in just a moment. I haven't even looked because it's on this screen. You're on my, my cell phone over here. But uh, I, I hope you're doing wonderful. I, I hope that you can share with me uh, your, your elephants in pink tutus. In fact, under this thread here, please uh, add your picture and, and share with the world the magic that you brought forth from those four magic words.